Hi, I'm Jen Zielinski down here at the Cook Boat Launch in Kelowna, where a suction dredge is taking place to get rid of a sandbar that caused serious issues for boaters this summer. The dredging was supposed to take place back in August, but was put off until this October. We've got a vacuum style dredge. It, it uh, sucks up the sand and, and pumps it. It's got an auger that draws everything to the center. The pump grabs a hold of it and pumps it up to the geotextile tubes. Each geotextile tube this size holds about a thousand cubes of sand, cubic meters, and we've got six tubes all together. We're going to fill three first. The Cook Boat Launch is expected to be closed until the end of November, but according to Lake Water Restoration, the length of the job really depends on the sand itself. This sand is different from other sand. Light, and light ends are, you know, silt is different than sand. And how much silt and how much rocks and how much is in here, that'll make a difference on how much we can pump. And the, we seem to be making a pretty good dent in this in a short time, so. Environmental mitigation and site operations were complete before this one-of-a-kind vacuum-style pump could be brought into the lake. Fisheries has been here and, and caught any fish that are within the work area. So the work area is isolated and any turbidity that happens to be created by us is trapped within the silk curtains so it doesn't get out into the lake and trouble the fish. And once the sand is sucked up and picked up by the city of Kelowna, it will be taken to the nearby beaches. For Castanet News, I'm Jen Zielinski.